Hello everyone, my name is Michael Sherry. Today I'm featuring a 2021. Yes, first 2021 of the year. It's a Forest River Cherokee Wolf Pup and also it's a brand new model for this year. Uh, never before has this been produced. It's a 16 TS. Big bay window in the back. Uh, this is a Wolf Pup so it's going to be under 4,000 pounds. We can tell this with almost any pull vehicle out there in the market uh, most suvs and probably about any pickup truck out there uh, and we'll just get started and flip this camera around and here we go all right this is the all new 2021 forest river cherokee wolf pup cherokee is a part of the forest river lineup and they are the top producer of pullable rvs in america and have been for a couple years and there's various reasons why they do that but a lot of it is just the big amount of value that they put into their trailers without a crazy price tag a couple cool features uh, this year still has the aerodynamic front end it's a three-piece front end two pieces of, of a metal and the bottom is a rock guard to protect the front end of this trailer it has a 20 pound propane tank and this also comes with the juice pack which will be the big 27 series battery typically you get a 24 series battery on an RV and also the solar panel on the roof comes in that juice pack a couple cool things I, that just tickle me uh, it has a holder up here for your seven pin plug which I like because that usually just dangles and then also they added a holder here for your chains I've never seen that before so that's nice the outside of this is full full body paint. Uh, they've painted all the metal on the Cherokee. Uh, a lot of companies are still doing a lot of decals and stickers. So uh, if you don't know what that means, just look at a used metal sided trailer and look how the decals and stickers uh, look after a couple years of in the sun. So having the full body paint is a really big, nice, feature that's going to make this trailer look good for years and years to come single axle does have the radial tires on it so a lot of competition still uses a bias ply trailer tire and the reason they do that is mostly just because it's less expensive uh, the radial tire is going to ride cooler so it's going to last longer and also you get more rubber on the road with a radial tire it does come with the spare tire which is an option and this travel rack back here which is also an option this travel rack will fold down and you can put bicycles on there maybe a portable generator uh, totes of different kind of things so that is a really nice feature and notice the really big bay window really lets a lot of natural light in once you get inside Coming to the more of the fun side of the camper, it does have the power awning I have just out just a little bit to show you. And I also have this really cool outside uh, compartment here. It comes with a workstation here, nice sturdy door, and then also a dorm style refrigerator with a little freezer portion up here. They got it taped up, but that there is the freezer portion. So if you want to make some ice cubes or things of that sort, you can. Also outside here, there is uh, outside speakers with built in LED uh, uh, lights. They are marine grade speakers, so they can get wet. No trouble there. And then also you have some outside hookups here. There's your uh, coaxial and video hookup and your power hookup. Good storage outside here. That's going to go nearly uh, the whole space of the underneath of a queen bed to give you an idea. It's a big space there and comes with a solar charge uh, station here. If you want to add another solar panel, there is one up on the roof. All right, again, this is the 16TS by Forest River Cherokee and all Forest River products. Uh, uh, Forest River in general partners with KOA and together they're sending kids who have cancer to camp. They recognize that nature has a lot of healing properties and they, they want to get these kids who are just having a rough time right now out in nature and, and get some of that healing. Uh, this has the more ride steps, which I really like. They're going to fold up inside the camper when you're not using the camper or when the camper is in travel mode. So they stay out of the elements, so they're not going to get all rusty up. And I like that they hit the ground so they're nice and sturdy. When you come in, there's no bouncing. Weight on this is under 3,300 pounds, 3,282. So again, super lightweight. Off to the right or the front of the trailer is going to be your queen bed up front here. It has a USB charging station and normal electric here on the bed and then storage above the bed these cabinets and then also comes with a television mount which is new for this year has a nice swing arm television mount so you can possibly even watch this at the booth dinette which i'll show you in a second here and then all your uh 
television hookups are already wired in your normal electric it does have the antenna with the antenna booster right here so you're going to be able to pick up those over the air broadcast channels for free and then your audio video cables right here all right looking towards the rear of the trailer we have our kitchen off to the left big kitchen booth in the rear look at that big bay window rooftop air conditioner a lot of companies in this size trailer are still putting the little window air conditioner in the side but this has the rooftop real rv air conditioner and speakers in the ceiling here led lights and those as well and then in this room right here you have a separate bathroom which has a stand-up shower some shelves in the shower to hang your stuff uh, i'm six foot tall in here and this ceiling is a few inches probably five or six inches taller than me so i'll uh, give you an idea on height it does have enough room to sit down on the stool and there's a vent in the shower here as well countertop here a lot of countertop space and the reason that is they have this countertop uh extender on top of the circle stainless steel sink here high-rise faucet as well and then the countertop extender on top of the stove when you're not using it it's got the glass top uh two burner gas stove top there and then it has the extender off the side so that's nice uh for your hot pocket eaters got a nice stainless steel microwave the turntable in it and it even has a little vent on top of here so when you are cooking on the stove top you can get the steam and that kind of stuff out of here so a lot of windows all these windows will open for some nice ventilation and then the table here is a nice size table that's going to fold down for extra sleeping as well and then here this is special it says a 10 cubic foot refrigerator i don't think anyone else building this size of trailer has this big of a refrigerator nice feature 12 volt as well that works pairs really well with that uh uh, power or that juice pack with a solar panel uh, and uh, that bigger battery uh, the radio here this is where all your tunes are going to come from this is a bluetooth am fm hdmi port usb port aux port you know if there's a port it's probably got it and also you can tell how much power you're making right now we're making 11.8 volts right now on this sunny day Okay, that completes this walkthrough on this new 2021 Wolf Pup. So I gotta get used to saying that the 2021s are coming out. Uh, we're excited about them, so make sure you check them out. I'll post links below of our current inventory, current pricing, uh, finance availability link as well, trading availability. We'd love to have your trading for looking upgrade. So give us an opportunity on that. Thanks for watching everyone. If you find yourself in the store, hunt me down and say hi. Thanks for watching.